occupies everywhere in our daily lives from jotting down our class notes to printing important documents and even wrapping gifts yet have you ever thought of the hidden cost associated with paper production and disposal over the last 40 years global paper consumption has surged an astonishing 400% this dramatic increase has had a significant impact on our environment sparking my curiosity this summer one summer afternoon while tidying my room i was struck by the sheer amount of paper that accumulated books notebooks and papers scattered everywhere the amount of discarded paper was overwhelming and made me realize how little i knew about paper from its creation to its end determined to understand more i started researching paper's production and its environmental impact to make paper we need two critical resources water and trees about 17000 gallons of water is used for every ton of paper produced at first glance this may not seem like a lot but we must consider that we don't just make a single ton rather a whopping 240 million tons of paper every year that translates to a staggering 71 trillion gallons of water being used just for paper production every year to put this into comparison the united states uses 117 trillion gallons of water for all its necessities in a year that means we use about 60% of the water used by the united states in a year just for paper production how can we justify such excessive water use only to make paper when so many other needs exist but it doesn't end with water does it because to make paper we also require trees and about 40% of the world's harvested timber is used just for paper production to put that into perspective one ton of paper requires 24 trees while making 240 million tons of paper every year we harvest about 5.76 billion trees additionally when paper is used it has to be thrown out and paper alone accounts for 40% of mass at landfills worldwide Paper recycling is a common practice but only 38% of paper is recycled while 56% of it is just landfilled amounting to 143000 trucks every day or roughly 2 trucks every second a shocking fact about paper consumption is that if we were to stack all the paper we use in a single year it would be 12 feet tall and would stretch all the way from new york to california This staggering statistic highlights the enormous scale of paper wastage every single year. Given these challenges, is it worth continuing with traditional paper? What if I told you the solution lied in something as simple as the chalk your teacher uses? The key lies in calcium carbonate, a mineral found in chalk, limestone and marble. Enter stone paper, an innovative material revolutionizing the paper industry. Stone paper also known as rock paper is made when calcium carbonate or limestone is first crushed into a fine powder. This powder is then added to HDPE, high density polyethylene. The mixture is then heated to form a molten composite. The molten composite is to be further extruded into thin sheets or rolls and could be calendared to achieve the desired thickness and smoothness. Stone paper is not only durable and water resistant but also offers a sustainable alternative to traditional paper unlike traditional paper which involves extensive tree harvestation and water usage stone paper saves millions of gallons of water and billions of trees every single year stone paper also uses scrap from construction which improves our resource efficiency and reduces waste although The production cost of stone paper is competitive with traditional paper its environmental benefits are priceless Stone paper can also be re- recycled countless times without losing its quality making it an eco-friendly alternative Is stone paper easy to use Absolutely it functions just like a regular paper perfect for writing folding and printing As former US President Barack Obama wisely said Climate change is no longer some far off issue. It's happening here, it's happening now. So let's embrace this change today. Adopt stone paper. If not now, when? Thank you.